is going on fellow gamers today is a thursday tomorrow is friday and the weekend is here but let's move along with why you guys came here paladins is not a game that i am personally familiar with i've heard about it but i have not played it myself it's a hero shooter similar to that of overwatch some people claim that it's a carbon copy of overwatch but they've announced something interesting today it has been revealed that the game will have a pubg like mode in 2018 so essentially a 100 player survival mode this is how the game is described the game is designed from the ground up to be played in teams players must work to together to survive in paladins battlegrounds yes that's what the game will be called paladins battlegrounds which a lot of people have an issue with supports struggle to keep their frontliners alive while damage champions let the bullets fly and flanks look for any possible assassination for anybody who doesn't know the previous sentence was a play on the different classes that the game has supports frontliners damage and flanks so just to read a quick description of each of these classes support which are champions with high utility and healing abilities essentially the backbone of any team so this sounds like a meta class the frontliners heroes who serve as the anchor of the team holding the front and protecting their allies this sounds like a heavy class damage heroes who possess reliable consistent damage outputs or large bursts of damage potential which sounds like an assault class and flank champions who excel at traversing the battlefield and getting behind enemy lines eliminating vulnerable key targets again this sounds like a sniper class to continue on with the game's description players spawn into a massive map over 300 times the square footage of a typical paladin's siege map then they hop onto their mounts and begin exploring looting their way through more than four dozen outposts and tracking zeppelins that drop legendary gear as the fog contracts the stakes are raised the team last standing wins and that's not easy with 100 players all fighting to win i just wanted to make a couple of notes before i go on with my opinion and my reaction to other people's reaction to the new announcement and this game i just want to point out it's a team based game there's no solo mode this game also has classes pubg does not have that this game also has mounts which you can debate on that pubg has cars and vehicles which could also mounts could be seen as a different form of a vehicle but again these two games take on a different form of the original mode of 100 people trying to survive now i'll say this the game being being called paladins battlegrounds is kind of a shitty move on them to basically exactly call it paladins battlegrounds similar to player unknowns battlegrounds so i guess you can call it in the future as pbg instead of pubg and maybe people will be confused thinking that this game is that game and i don't know what to really say about that that's a crappy move by them they should have named it something different but they did what they did but now i'm also seeing people complaining over the fact that this game is copying the same mode that pubg has now i just want to point out that pubg is just a game mode it's just a mode about 100 people trying to survive in different ways singles duos squads whatsoever whatever you want to call it but it's also just a mode at the end of the day now for people trying to complain about it being copied in fortnite and now in paladins that sounds completely ridiculous because each of these games have made their own rendition of what pubg originally had now i have respect for pubg and what they're doing it's great that other games for me personally are taking on what they're doing and making it their own because it's kind of ridiculous to complain about it because you could look back and say that the first game that created created deathmatch which i think was doom if it ever was copied that the other game should be called out and then not every shooter today would have a deathmatch mode the mode has become a standard so same thing with PUBGs and this 100 player survival mode it's just going to be a standard mode that probably people will expect in shooters in the future probably 
And for me, I just really need people to stop complaining over every other game that takes on this mode because it's just a mode. And for the people over at Blue Hole, if they want to run their mouth like they did with Fortnite, they should focus more so on their game and their glitches than bitching about other people copying their mode because I feel like they're kind of worried that they actually have to put in effort in their own game. So that's it at the end of the day. This game, Paladins Battlegrounds, will be added as a free mode to whoever owns paladins but again paladins is a free to play game it's on the playstation 4 xbox one and pc and also the mac so everybody can get on this paladins battlegrounds mode which i will do personally i haven't played the regular game but i am really into this battlegrounds this battle royale this 100 player survival type of mode it's interesting it's new it's a fresh take on what we've had for shooters for a long time so paladins battlegrounds whenever it comes i'll definitely download the game and i suggest everybody else to download the game just to push this further and other games incorporating their own way for this 100 player type of mode i also wonder what if a game like assassin's creed decided to include a 100 player uh mode like on the origins map that would for me that would be insane and just better for gamers so for people out there stop complaining be excited that more games are taken on this mode and don't listen to what blue hole says or does don't pledge allegiance to a game like pubg versus versus Fortnite. In the end of the day, they're all games for us. Putting your allegiance just tries to make more money for the company, which again, if you want to support them, do that and that you do that by playing the game. You don't have to put everybody else down who plays a game that's different than yours. But again, that's the core issue with gamers nowadays is that we complain about everything. Gamers complain about everything. But at the end, I'm looking forward to this. Whenever it drops in 2018, I will personally download Paladins Battlegrounds and I will play it on my PS4 Pro. But that's it for the video. If you did enjoy it, please hit that like button. It really supports the page. And subscribe if you're new. I got a video every other day, except days where there's something really interesting. And I'll just post the video on that day. I'll check you guys out on the next one.